He's gone upstairs in the gaffer's office and put the gaffer's gear on and come back down in the gaffer's gear. <laughs> I will tell you what he did to me once. We went to Austria pre-season um, and we were in the same training camp as Real Madrid. David Beckham was there, Jonathan Woodgate, Capello was manager. I was at Fulham with, with Jimmy, Chris Coleman manager. So... Uh, we used to meet for breakfast before we went training. We'd, we'd get, get up, have breakfast. And it used to be a buffet breakfast. Mm -hmm. And the yogurts were in a big bowl. And you used to help yourself to how much yogurt you wanted on your cereal and all that. Now, Real Madrid used to sit over one end of the room. And we used to sit over the other end of the room. I think we were a bit starstruck more than anything, to be honest. Now, <laughs> my bedroom, I'm sharing with Mark Pembridge, and my bedroom is above the kitchen's. And it's red hot in there. Uh -huh. So I can't keep my mouth shut. So I come down the next morning in front of everybody and I go, Gaffer, to Chris Coleman. What's up, mate? I said, you got to change me. you got to get me out of that room. I said, I can't sleep. There's no way I can go out training today when I can't sleep. I find training hard as it is. And with that temperature in there, I'm sweating my nuts off all night. I can't, I, I, you've got to change my rooms. Jimmy Bullard comes up behind me and he's picked up the yogurt bowl and he pours it over my head and he goes, that'll cool you down, big fella. <laughs> and all I can see at the other end of the room there is Capello like that, looking over his glasses as if to think, what the hell is going on here? And I'm stood there and I've got a full, full bowl of yogurt dripping down right off me. But that, hey. Jimmy, mate, is uh, is he's, he's just one of them people that he, do, he does something. He'll let fire extinguishers off in the training. He'll do all anything stupid. The first day he signed for us at Fulham, we used to meet on these steps, and Chris Coleman would go, right, this is what we're doing this morning. You're going off for a warm-up with so-and-so, da -da -da. then you're going to come over to me. We're going to go through some team shape and all that. And then he'd go, right, off you go, do your warm-up with Chris. The, the fitness coach. So we'd all jog off and like, where's Jimmy? He was here a minute ago. Where is he? Well, he disappeared back into the dressing room and he'd put the green Borat outfit on, you know, the mankini. So we were all run off training. Next minute, Jimmy comes running around the back of the training ground and joins in and he's got the mankini on. And that was his first day training. His first day training. And the next day, he get, he, we meet on the steps. He's gone upstairs in the gaffer's office and put the gaffer's gear on and come back down in the gaffer's gear. <laughs> <laughs> I, it, there's only him. He's one of them people. Where it, there's only him that can that could get away with it. You know what I mean? Great lad. Good mate of Jimmy's. Great lad. Mm -hmm.